there's bugs in here. What do I do? Look, I will be the better chef. Ew. My steak is smoking. Wait, what do, honestly, what do I do? Say it! <laughs> Say I'm it. going to go with. Hey guys, I'm Veronica. I'm Vanessa. And we're going to see who can make the best gourmet meal with 20 bucks. Every time we cook on videos or live streams, you guys know it's always a fail ah! for some reason. And today we're going to prove to you guys that we can be gourmet chefs. Yeah, but we're gonna show you guys who is the better chef. I'm the better chef for sure. No, I, I just am. I don't know, but the person who's gonna be judging who the better gourmet chef is, is going to be our dad, Paul Merrill. He's right there. You guys are gonna fail. What? what? No! Okay, maybe because the camera is pointed on us, but when the camera is off, we always cook delicious meals. I'm gonna do great, Nessa's gonna do okay. I don't I'm have- I'm gonna do awesome, what do you mean? <laughs> We're, we'll see about that. All right guys, so I am very bougie, and I eat at fancy restaurants every single day, basically. Not every day, but I've gone to fancy restaurants and I believe the more gourmet it is, the smaller the portion. So uh, let's take a look at the lobster I'm gonna be cooking for my dad today. Oh, it's small. Small means gourmet, more fancy. I got a filet mignon for 12 bucks. Do you know how much filet mignons are at restaurants? This is actually really small. But it's okay because alongside my small lobster is a shrimp skewer. Here is my filet mignon. Are you hungry? I hope you are. I got the biggest piece of filet mignon they had, so. Do you mm. know how I like mine cooked? Medium? Well, medium rare. Rare. I'm not gonna tell you. Medium! You like a medium? Oh my gosh, there's bugs in here! In my time! Wait, what do, honestly, what do I do? Mommy, there's bugs in my time. <laughs> I couldn't find the time. Uh, it's on your phone. <laughs> <laughs> so, Ronnie, the reason why you have bugs in your time is because this time is meant to be planted in a pot, not cooked. <sighs> Fail already. No! Yeah. No! It's yeah. not true! He's gonna have extra protein in his meal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I got all my ingredients for tw under 20 bucks, like a couple dollars. Couple dollars. I don't remember how much this was. A couple cents and then twelve dollars. Mine's also under twenty bucks because I got shrimp and lobster, broccolini, garlic and parsley and old bay seasoning. It's kind of a lot, but everything was under twenty bucks. So I'm ready. My gourmet meal is gonna be shrimp and lobster. My gourmet meal is gonna be filet mignon with carrots and mashed potatoes. Oh, and bro bro broccolini for me. First, we're gonna take our lobster tail and cut it down the middle. I'm going to peel a potato. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? I have nothing. Nothing. Ew! Ew! My lobster has the gross stuff on it. It has like that poopy stuff. Poopy Ugh. stuff? I don't know what it is. I have to wash it. <laughs> Ronnie! Oh, it's all my shrimp! Ronnie the gnats! Really? Yes! Really? Yes! I'm being what do I do? Look, I don't want my fish getting gnats all over them. Stand over it and shoo them away. Okay, I just, I'm trying to get the meat out but put it on top of the lobster. You, you know what I mean? So it looks pretty. <gasps> this is not my first time making lobster. It just, there's that part in the lobster that just kind of grosses me out a little. I don't know how do people make the, the lobster look so pretty on top. Like you know when they go like this? That's all they do. Is this is this it? Yeah. Chef Veronica. So I'm gonna make my butter that goes on top of the lobster. Uh, the key, this is the key to good lobster, is get a lot of butter, but we're gonna melt it and then put lemon juice with it, but with a little bit of parsley, some Old Bay seasoning, and garlic. Got my carrots here. I'm going to roast or bake my carrots. I'm going to season my carrots and garlic salt. Hello? Hello? Ah! Those are gonna go in the oven. Okay. 
Got my potatoes boiling. I'm gonna pour the butter on the lobster like so. Then I'm gonna put some Old Bay seasoning on it. Make sure it's like pretty seasoned with the Old Bay. I think this garlic is like making my nose run. Mmm, that smells good. Look at me, this is called a gourmet chef uh, technique. Is it? Mm -hmm. okay, I'm about to look like a professional chef right here. Just kidding. <laughs> Just really cut that parsley, you know? Minced up. Twinkle on the lobster. That looks beautiful. That is called art. This is gonna go in the oven now. <gasps> oh no! What? I didn't preheat my oven. Oh, I'm gonna broil it. It's time to gen generously salt my filet mignon. That's kind of a lot of salt. I'm the chef here. Okay. I once read that the worst thing is an under-seasoned steak. This sounds like that one time that goes dun, 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 Tokyo Drift. No? All right, so um, now we're gonna move on to my shrimp and uh, broccolini. But remember, less is more because it's a gourmet meal. But we're gonna do five pieces of broccolini because odd numbers is fancier than even numbers. So one, two, three, four, five. Let's rinse these. Hold on, Ronnie, Ronnie's cheating. What do you Wait, mean? Ronnie, you're cheating. I have an Aaron sent you a full oh. on. Aaron what? sent you. That's not cheating. You're phoning a friend. No, uh, no I'm not. This instructions, otherwise I'd be watching a TikTok. I am doing everything from memory and you are getting help from your husband. I don't see the it's problem. It's a literally step by step tutorial. I don't see the problem. He's helping me. Okay, no phones, Ronnie. No, I She's need my right. phone. She's right. I need my phone. I have to time things. Okay, okay well, I'm no gonna time. Cheating, though. I, need... I have to. I've never done it like this before. I've only seen Aaron do it. You gotta do. I'm it. trying to prove myself that I'm the best gourmet chef. By cheating. That's not cheating. Nessa, are you using Otherwise, I'd be looking at someone else's instructions. It is cheating because Aaron's helping you. No, he, I looked at, look. One I have way to, to get Ronnie mad is I, tell her she's cheating. No. She is. I'm not. Comment below if you think Ronnie's cheating. <laughs> this is not cheating. <laughs> I'm trying to be the best gourmet chef. Gourmet chef looks at recipes. A real gourmet chef has it memorized. Like me, gourmet chef Vanessa has her Entire recipe memorized and is making some of it up now because I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I kind of thought maybe I would grill it, but here we are. My potatoes, they're not soft yet. Ow! Oh, sorry. He's trying to sacrifice me. Ah. Oh, it's burning me. It's burning me. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh my! Ow! It's burning me! Sister coming to the rescue! Honestly, you can never go wrong with shrimp or mess up shrimp. Shrimp by itself is so good. I'm focused. I'm focused. <laughs> I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That shrimp smells so good. Oh, wow. Ooh, I look like a professional chef over here. Five, four, three, two, one. Face, face. I'm doing a terrible job at basting. Now I need to make my broccolini. I'm gonna use the same things in here. It's on low. I thought I'd go like that. Wow! What the heck? Damn it! I'm almost 
done with my meal. Six minutes. <sighs> come on, potatoes. Do not feel me. Potatoes, come on. Be soft. They're not soft. Oh, my goodness. Look at that lobster. I think I did a good job. I don't know what I'm doing with the potatoes. Okay, I'm plating it, and then I'm gonna plate my broccolini. Cause I want the broccolini to still be pretty crunchy. It's not done. I need to put some butter sauce and lemon sauce on the uh, lobster. I will be the better chef. Okay, so I'm just gonna make um, some butter lemon sauce cause my dad loves that. And I'm trying to win this challenge. Forgot to cover it. It's popping. I need to melt it somehow. I don't know how else to melt it. I'll just clean it later, I guess. I do too. It's I the, I know the reasoning for this. I knew it would happen, but I thought there might be a chance. There was melted butter at the bottom, which was the thing that was popping. My steak is smoking. My lobster's not smoking. In fact, well, look at this. Look how cute that is. That has lemon and butter in it because my dad likes to dip his lobster in lemon and butter. Stop. Okay. All right. Wait, wait, Nessa. I need that. Yeah. yeah. No, I need that now. I know. Okay, Nessa. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Have it rest, it needs to rest on a plate. Just cleaning up, because I'm killing time, because my food is ready. It's waiting. Here, guys, come here. We have this cool thing. We have this drawer right here. When you open it, it's actually like, it's a heater, so it's keeping this warm. That way the food is warm, and the judge doesn't judge me for having cold food. My food is ready. Right. I'm shaking. <laughs> I'm shaking because of how scared I am. Made my mashed potatoes, carrots, and I've plated my steak in a, the fanciest way that I could. Okay, so now it is time for the real test. We have our professional judge, Paul Merrill, our dad. He's He's been a professional judge for years. Ready? And lobster and shrimp. Ooh, this looks good. All right. Why is it so tiny? Because tiny is fancier. All right. Oh. <laughs> it disappeared. Hold on. This is all like two bites, maybe. Okay. That's, but it's because it's fancy. And that's butter and lemon juice nice. for you. All right, here we go. Let's see how this can taste. It's lemony. <laughs> it's good. It's a good flavor. I'm gonna try the broccoli first. Okay, this is the broccolini. Huh. He, he, frown, he frowns. Hmm. It's an interesting flavor. What? What, what, what does it taste like? It, he, he has to tell you I, after. I'll okay, tell you okay, after. fine. Oh. <laughs> have the shell on it. Mm. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I didn't know I had the shell on it either. You fed him the shell. No, he did. Look what the shell, shell is wrong with you? Keeping the shell on is fancy. All right, I've had enough. <gasps> I don't want to eat too much. I mean, okay. I, I would eat the whole thing. It's it's okay. good. So he says he would eat the whole thing and that, that it's good. All right, here is my dish. Filet Ooh. mignon with mashed potatoes Ooh. and carrots. I think you should Cut the steak to see if it's exactly how you like it. <laughs> it's a little well done. It's a little well done, a but bit. it cut very well. Let me just cut a little further into it. Ooh. Ooh, it's it's more like a medium kind of thing. Should I go ahead and try it? Not medium at all. I'm sorry. 
Okay, here we go. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Pairs well together. You yeah, just isn't saying anything, Ron. I know. Just hold on. I'm. I'm. At all. I have thoughts. I don't want to say until I'm done. Let's try the carrots. A little crunchy, but flavorful. Hmm. Okay. Can I have the lobster back in here? <gasps> we're talking about gourmet meal, right? Mm -hmm. That's what we're yes. talking about. We'll start with the lobster. The lobster was really good, Nessa. It, it tasted great, all that. The butter, a little too, little too lemony, but not a deal breaker. The lobster was a little small. It's gourmet. I don't consider that gourmet. I, I, I could eat it in like three bites. It uh, was made with art. <laughs> it's small and I'm a man and I like food. The other thing that I feel like is not very gourmet is um, the shrimp on skewers. I'm gonna pay for a gourmet meal. I just don't think it should be on wood. It should be at least like a silver skewer. That wouldn't have cost you anything else to do that. We have those. That is okay, but that's not even judging the actual food. You're judging the I do the, the presentation skewer. as well. Your presentation though was very nice. I give it an A for presentation. For like the amount of food, eh. You use a little bit more. How much do you think a restaurant would charge for that meal? 80. <laughs> if I paid 80 bucks for that, I would never come back. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> but it's supposed to be gourmet. It's, uh, look. What it, about the taste of the lobster? The lobster is, it's really good. It tastes good. It just wasn't quite enough. That's just all I'm saying. Like you're, so you're saying it's not gourmet because it wasn't enough food. It wasn't balanced correctly. Just a little bit more, a little bigger for $80. If it's you would have charged me 80 bucks for that. It was made with love. <laughs> I will give you that. It was made with love. Okay. Veronica, your steak uh, was, the, the presentation was really good. I would say it was equal presentation. Both were presented very well. The steak uh, was uh, kind of medium, but it was mostly medium on one side versus the other. I don't know if you can see, but let me just point out. So see this part right here, this part right here, is pink and that part is brown. So it was more medium on one side versus the other. So that, I mean, gourmet meal wise, it should be perfectly pink in the center, equal distances on both sides of the cooking. <laughs> the flavor of the steak was good, was a tick salty. Just a, a tick salty. That's, that's my one critique, two critiques of it. Um, the potatoes, uh, very average. Um, <laughs> it didn't really like enhance the food. So something I like is like I like to take a piece of steak, eat it, chew it a little bit, then go ahead and have the potatoes while I'm still chewing the steak, and it needs to prepare nicely. It was just potatoes. The carrots, on the other hand, I, honestly, very very good. They were they were delicious. The carrots were great. The your seasoning, all of that. Okay, thank you. So, thank um, you. Okay, me, so, hold on. I'm wait, not wait, I have done. To stop. He's not done. He's not done. Did you just fart? No, I, I did this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, meal portions, great. Like, like I feel like proportionately wise, it was for gourmet meal. It was the right amount. Okay, so I have to remind you that we were only allowed to spend maximum of twenty dollars on each meal. Okay. So, with that in mind, which meal was more gourmet with only twenty dollars? With only twenty bucks? Yeah, that's what. So that's the question. It's not what's the better meal. It's what? No, ha, who did no, the better? The question is which is the better. Which is meal? the better meal for twenty dollars? Hmm. <laughs> you that's have to really decide. hard. I'm you going have to. to I'm going to decide. Don't be mad at me. Hmm. Which meal was better? Which tasted better? <laughs> Which tasted Which, better? Uh, here's the problem is I, every time I go somewhere, I get steak and lobster. The steak was good. The lobster was good. But for the sake of the challenge. Why are you so nervous? Because, because I have to, after the camera goes off, I have to live with you guys. <laughs> for 20 bucks, the better, better meal for 20 bucks. Just 
Say it! I'm going to go with the steak. <laughs> you said the steak was salty. It was salty, but. Give me a piece. I, <laughs> I want to try this. Just try it. It's... I worked so hard. Salty? So Brony won, yay! <laughs> Who do you think won this challenge? Which meal would you eat? Let us know in the comments below and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye.